Ever since its creation, many fans of the Jeepers Creepers franchise have often wondered for many years as to just who or what the creeper who has appeared in Jeepers Creepers 1 and 2 truly is, and many have often speculated in saying that the creeper is simply that of a man, while others have suggested that the creeper is some kind of an animal, while others have made claims that it is a demon, and in this video we're going to be sharing our thoughts and opinions alongside providing evidence as to just who or what the creeper monster may actually be. Now, after having to watch both the first and second movies, it's obvious as day that the creeper monster seen isn't by any means any kind of animal. Reasons for this is due to its ability to fully drive a truck on an open road, and animals just don't simply hop in a truck and drive, which entirely rules out all notions that the creeper is some kind of ancient animal. And besides, in the deleted scenes of the first movie, the creeper, when walking outside the house of the old lady who he had killed inside, spoke briefly to Derry as the creeper said, she don't smell too good, Darius, which is a clear indication that indeed the creeper can speak, and in Jeepers Creepers 2 towards the end, we see how Jack Sr. had the creeper on display with a sign above his head saying bat out of hell, which is another indication that indeed this actually may be a demon rather than a man and an animal. Now the reasons and the traits for this is the way the creeper targets its victims. Unlike any sort of animal or serial killer, the creeper has preferences and key specifics when picking out a new victim in which even stated in the first and second films, if the creeper finds something that he likes, whatever he eats becomes a part of him. And what other man do you know of that eats something and then becomes a part of him? We've seen how the creeper was able to sustain massive amounts of damage, including gunshots, decapitation, and even a harpoon having to go through its body, alongside also being stabbed through the heart multiple times, and resulting the creeper having to still be alive in both the first and second films. And alongside that, the creeper is also shown to have wings on its back. No other animal in size is known to have wings of that long of a span, and alongside that of a man, people just don't have wings on their back, which in doubt raises a red flag as this is not an animal or a man. And having a look back on Jeepers Creepers 2, we have several flashback scenes of the creeper having to be embedded on shields and swords as it is seen that this creature has been around for thousands of years with people being unable to stop the creature and its pursuit of eating every 23 days every 23rd spring as we see the creeper out and about looking for its victims. And having to compare his overall features, we see that the creeper appears to be fairly masculine with of course a humanoid figure with a fairly odd disguise resembling that of a 19th century person. Having a closer look up on both the first and second films, we see how the creeper's skin is covered in thick dark greenish like scales with a fish like face, a bald head with hair behind its back, wings, and alongside many other traits that may be revealed in Jeepers Creepers 3. Now it strikes me as odd that this creature only happens to exist for 23 days every 23 spring just to feast. Its abilities, however, are also known to regenerate as we've seen the creature be decapitated with the ability to grow its own head back. Now a man or an animal can't simply do that. We also pick up on the idea that its nose is able to pick out scents and people as we saw in Jeepers Creepers 2 the creeper was using this trait to scent out the kids inside the bus, which ultimately rules out that both he is a man or animal, when in fact it is also stated that he's been around for thousands and thousands of years, which in conclusion allows me to believe that the creeper is some sort of ancient demon that only has the opportunity to be around for 23 days every 23 springs to feast upon its victims, and each time it needs something, each time it picks something out in people, whatever it is he picks out in that person, and he begins to eat becomes a part of him. But post your comments down below, what are your overall thoughts as to what the creeper creature may be? Do you guys believe that the creeper is a demon? Do you guys believe that this creature is some sort of an alien? Post your theories and your speculations down below. Thank you all for watching. If you guys are fans of Jeepers Creepers, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. That way you guys are always notified with all the latest in Jeepers Creepers news information, updates, and discussions. If you guys cannot wait for Jeepers Creepers 3, go ahead and slap a like down below. Tune back in for more, and I'll be seeing you all down the comment section below. Take it easy, guys. Peace.